it I got back to the Inquisition again, and now, whew, time to end this whole thing. Let the shit storm commence, I suppose, considering what the trailer show. Let's get this over with. Starting the exam, the council will lock off spending time with followers. I've done everything I can, so let's do this. Here we go. Thank you, Your Holiness. Now, Artigan, as to your concerns. The Inquisition established an armed presence in Ferelden territory. You outright seized Care Bronach in Crestwood. It was a bandit stronghold! Yes, from bandits. Would you like us to give it back to them? Your help was appreciated two years ago, Inquisitor. Now order has been restored, yet you remain. Invading under pretext of restoring order is exactly what the Grey Wardens did to us centuries ago, and we exiled them. Now the Inquisition is doing the same thing with Grey Wardens in their ranks. Your concern is ill-founded. The Grey Wardens have proven their worth time and again. Of course Orle tolerates this interference. The Inquisition is the only reason Gaspard sits upon the throne. Rest assured, Tegan, the Empire of Orle will not stand idle if the Inquisition oversteps its bounds. Unlike Ferelden, however, Orle understands that these were the well-intentioned mistakes of a young organization. Organization in need of a guiding hand. Yours, no doubt. Pardon me, Inquisitor. Divine Victoria wishes to speak with you in private. She's right there. But the Divine Victoria, who is sitting just up there. Yes, and who was once your spy master. Okay, okay. Please pardon me, everyone. My apologies. An urgent matter has come to my attention. Ambassador Montillier, can you handle this for a short while? I... of course, Inquisitor. This is highly irregular. Perhaps it would be best if we took a short recess. <sighs> I am seriously going to say what they said at that... in the trailer. Something odd going on, alright, I think. I think we know who's behind us. I'm saying anything actually now. The guard said we should both see this. I believe she was correct. Who? Warrior in full armor. How did he get into the Winter Palace? What can you tell me? So what would the left hand of the divine see when she looked at this? This is a warrior, not a spy. Part of the Anton, the Canari military. Most of his wounds come from a fight against someone using magic, but at least a few are from a blade. Okay. He badly hurt, separated from his allies, and made it here before he died. But how? Would Iron Bull know? Doubt it, considering he doesn't have a connection with the Canari anymore. Would the Iron Bull know anything about this? I ask. And he is as surprised as we are. Since becoming Tarvashov, he has had no contact with his people. He seems frustrated at not knowing more. <sighs> well, this brings back memories. Deadly mysteries of the Winter Palace. Throw in a Halla statue and some Caprice coins, and it's just like old times. <laughs> Can Josephine manage the diplomats while I look around? She will be fine. It's all speeches and posturing for the first few days anyway. Days? I will extend the recess as long as possible. I will also have our friends ready themselves for battle if need be. You think that's likely? I think the Exalted Council may be more exciting than we expected. Yay. And here I was hoping for a boring... Rotate? Rotate what? Oh. Well. This just took a strange turn. Oh, okay. I'm guessing... No getting out? You can't 
How much space do I have in my 20? Not a lot. Could I talk to anyone about this? Does any of them know about this? Hello. Bull? Just, just ask. Hey, boss. Okay. Nothing. Alright then. Well, I guess I'll just sell the little bits of crap I picked up. Wait, did I still have a few of those dog treats? Let's do this real quick. I did. <laughs> what is he doing? Uh... <laughs> uh. <laughs> now I've seen everything. <sighs> if I knew this before, I would have done it way sooner. <laughs> anyway. Alright. Let's follow the blood trail. Oh wait, uh, the shop first. Some of these things... I'm really not sure if I need them. Here, a lot of things could be sold. Including all these. Anything that's in here can be sold as well. These are so... I barely ever use something like this. The superior guard belt can also go... Excuse me. I don't know if I should keep these or not. Let's buy this back. See what else we can have to sell. I'll keep the rest. Bugger it all. Let's do this. There's something weird going on. And then Vols Kunari, as expected. But why this invasion now? Actually, I kind of figured that already myself. A blood trail. Yes. Now we can finally get up here and find out what that thing is up here. Bottle cologne. Interesting. Alright. Well, things just got weird. <sighs> things always get weird. Loot. Sorry, but we're still loading. I'll take anything I can find. So he came out of this, out of the palace. I saw this in the trailer, and this shouldn't be here. What is an alluvion doing out here? Okay, here we go. I'll bite. Well, I know who's uh, coming with me. Dorian, Varric, Cassandra. And it's going to be fun. The crossroads. Morrigan brought me here while showing me the alluvians. Wait, we're literally in the crossroads? That is impossible. That shouldn't be. Also, two of them leveled up, so we're going to have to take care of that little problem. He leveled up quite a bit. Time to put in some points in that passive area, I'd say. Knew there were more. Concentrated destination, manually detonating walking bomb now directs the explosion inward, dealing significantly more damage to the target, but none to any nearby enemies. Uh... 
If walking bomb, the effect spreads. Okay, so that's still the same. Lingering mark. Targets you kill with spirit will not fight for you longer and harder. You can now have multiple mark targets. When a mark target dies, a wisp appears and attacks you with, with you for a short time. Okay, we're toggling that. Interesting. But he has a lot of... I've got a lot of points to s spend on him, including in that area. The fire ones have always been useful, so we'll get those. The passives are just useful, so... Let's see, he has... V so he does have something. Bait and switch. You can fight for a longer time before leaping back and pull your closest enemy back with you. Using fallback plan resets all of your cooldowns. And this one, throw everything once... I like how this is. Shrapnel pyrotechnics. Okay, interesting, interesting. I gotta say. And it goes even further! Wow, this is getting deep. The upgrades have been completely overhauled. This is amazing! But now I've got even more points to spend. We'll just give him some crap just to go along with it. He basically has already been built into what I want. So what is... Th Whoa! They have really gone all out with this stuff. Blocking with shield will cause less stamina and generates more guard, but you cannot move while blocking. Okay, what about shield bash? Ring the bell. You now launch forward with shield bash and do greater damage to an enemy's guard. An enemy struck by shield bash and does now does no damage with its next attack. Interesting. What about the Templar ones? In their blood. Breath of Light. You are healed for each enemy you strike with Wrath of Heaven. Wrath of Heaven does even more damage. That is amazing. That is amazing. Warcry echoes across the battlefield, catching more enemies and taunting them for longer. Oh yeah, that seems useful. Call them out. You can challenge as many enemies as you want with no cooldown. Well, that is more useful, to be honest. They've changed this. What happened to Unbowed? This is so weird. I never knew this stuff. Elegant defense, energetic defense. Your barrier holds at full strength for longer before it begins to decay. Oh, definitely. Definitely. Arcing Surge. Chain Lightning never strikes the same target more than once, but it deals more damage with each new target it reaches. Yes, please. Exploding Bolt, Lightning Cascade. Lightning Bolt now paralyzes other enemies near your main target. The more enemies it affects, the more the shorter the duration. I prefer this one. Wildfire Consuming Immolate no longer has a cooldown, but casting it multiple times in succession costs additional mana. I prefer it as it is then. What does this do? Winter's Rune. Enemies that are already frozen or chilled take massive damage when hit with Winter's Grasp. That is pretty cool. So, how does this work here? Stasis Log. Enemies got... Charge Disruption. When enemies take damage inside the field, Spirit Blade gains... P oh, fuck me, me, yes. Enduring Cloak. The lower the charge on your Spirit Blade, the longer Fade Cloak lasts. Okay, that's pretty cool, but I prefer this one. I already s checked that out. This is pretty cool. I never knew they did this. When did they do this? Anyway. Well, there's a blood trail that leads to this one. But this one seems to be inactive. Judging by the blood stains, he tried to get through here. Is something wrong? This mirror doesn't look broken, but it's inactive. Maybe there's a way to unlock it. 
This is the crossroads, but it looks so different than before. Let's keep moving, though. Still have a lot to figure out. This is just... This is getting really weird now. I'll just go on a little bit longer. I'm not making this video too long. I got reasons, okay? I'm still scanning the entire... Scouring the entire area for goodies. You know, loot, that sort of thing. Uh, well, we could enter... I don't know what it will do. Let's first look around before I do anything. But just a question, how the hell Let us see where this Punari came from. I'm just curious. Um How did it an Alluvion an Alluvion ended up all the way in the Winter Palace? There were so few before that were active. Let's see where this leads to. If this is going to get awkward. Uh, the Imperial Library? Book of Butterflies. A lot of reading. Well, that's something, I guess. By the way, I might change in one of my abilities later. A faded letter. I'm not going to read this all here. Nobody's interested in that. Anyone who's watching this, anyway. I would love to read it, but I'll do that in other playthroughs I'm busy with for a little project I have in mind. Fate touched obsidian. In here? Oh, I have a, a skull. A portrait of a skull like that. Come on. You're not even trying anymore. This... This just screams bad news. A trap, basically. Let's see. I'll bite. There was a time where I went weeks without seeing a demon. Ugh. All right, let's see. Come on, Varric. Throw around blades. That's what you do best, after all. Is my Inquisitor... In in Where did he go? You're not getting away from me that easily. Oh, stop disappearing! And die already! Where did he go? Oh. Why do I keep going out of combat, though? Arcane Horror Heart. Corpse Heart. That's another Arcane Horror Heart, I guess. Yep. Typical stuff, you know. Okay, now what was in this thing? <coughs> the hand that cuts. The following stacking bonus is granted on ability usage. The taken shape. This ring, gro this ring grows unusually warm when slipped into a finger. It pulses slightly and steadily as if in time with the war. Where is heartbeat? Okay, I know that one of my characters doesn't have the best... Okay. This ring is extremely interesting. The, I think I know who I'm giving this to. Very could use something like this, you know? But that was that. I'm not going anywhere until I find out what the hell is going on here. This is getting really weird. Really weird. Well, back at the crossroads. <sighs> okay, I'll bite. Now, where the hell is this going to lead to? I can't guess. It's too blurry. Uh, 
Okay, I'm guessing we're no longer in the Winter Palace. I think I'll just see what this results into and then we'll see. Why is my heart beating like this is gonna end really, really badly? Elven ruins. I'm not sure we're even in Orle anymore. Okay. As much as I'd like to continue, I'm gonna have to call it quits here. This is getting very interesting, I'll have to say. We'll see how this goes. Okay. We'll see that. But you guys get to see that in the next video. So will I when I do the recording for it. So, without further ado, and without anything, this has been Dragon Age Inquisition, the Trespasser DLC, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye!